at the top, you would have a king. Now, the king would rule over a kingdom. Now, this is not so easy to govern, especially during the Middle Ages, and the king might owe many people things, especially people who helped the king come to power, helped him depose the previous king or to conquer this land. And so, in exchange for that, and to help govern, he might grant land or fiefs to other people. And the key currency in the Middle Ages, under the feudal system, is land, and land in exchange for loyalty and service. So, this whole thing is a kingdom. Now, right over here, this is a duchy. And a duchy will be controlled by a duke. I guess they didn't call it ducky, because that just doesn't sound as serious. So, the king might grant a duchy, a duchy to a duke, and in exchange, the duke would provide loyalty, pledge their fealty. If the kingdom is threatened, the duke will fight alongside the king, would provide their own troops. If the king wants to go conquer other territories, same thing. And also provide the king with taxes, which might be in the form of coinage, depending on what time and region we are in the Middle Ages. Or it might be in the form of a percentage of the agricultural production from this duchy.